sit back and relax because News Express will be right back after a short break. Oh my gee, 41 degrees Celsius, it's so hot! Oh no, Jana collapsed! Go to Nathan, some bathing, some ice, hurry! In these hot days, drink a lot of water, stay cool and stay hydrated. <laughs> Philippines at a time is 11 or 4 in the, in the morning. And we're back. This, this is, is News Express. Express. For the local news, the celebration of Stacey Fabiola's 2024. Here is what she'll have as for the update. Thank you, Jonathan. Today, in April 12, St. Thomas Aquinas College of Rose 2024, of the Pilgrims of Hope. Exploring pathways of telecality to continue with an exciting lineup of activities. From intense ball games like badminton, chess, and table tennis, to captivating academic competitions, calling for recitations and declamations. Students are showcasing their talents and skills across various fields. The campus values with energy as participants engage in friendly competitions and academic excellence, embodying the precision of camaraderie and sportsmanship. As the day progresses, students and spectators alike can look forward to an evening filled with cultural performances and artistic expressions. From vocal solos and folk dances to modern jazz and theme dances, the campus comes alive with creativity and talent. Stay tuned for more updates as St. Thomas Aquinas College of Rules 2024 continues to captivate and spark the community. For the local news, Rochelle Espinosa reporting. Thank you, Rochelle. For the international news, a 7.1 magnitude earthquake strikes in Taiwan. For more details, it's Jonah Mae Taiwan's most violent earthquake is hit by Duras Strap on Wednesday, April 3, 2024, resulting at least 9 fatalities and over 900 injuries, according to the country's authorities. The 7.4 magnitude quake happened around 8 a.m. local time at the <laughs> About 21 miles, according to the U.S. Geological Survey, the epicenter was about 11 miles south southwest of one city on the island's Pacific coast. It was the strongest earthquake to hit Taiwan since 1999, with a 7.6 magnitude tremor about 2,400 people, said Wu Xinhu, director of the Taiwan Seismological Center for the TYRB International News. This is John May Mana reporting. Drama, drama, no? The Philippines inflation rate for February was increased by 3.5%, which is within the government's target of 2.4%. This is seen as a positive sign, especially at the 